students this is the second bit from the first question here we have a elimination we have uh, two equations and uh, we have to do both the elimination method and substitution method let's see the first elimination method comparatively the um, this method is comparatively easy than uh, substitution method okay let's see the first equation is a 3x plus a 4y equal to 10 the second equation is equal to 2x minus 2y equal to 2. Now, uh, just you select any of the variable. Now it is a 3 and uh, 4 and here 2 and a 2. So I want to multiply selected this variable 4y. This term 4y. So to just I want to multiply the second equation both LHS and RHS with uh, 2 2 2s are 4 2 2s are 4 and 2 2s are 4 therefore now here no need to think about plus or minus just you think about the term 4y and here 4y now add them because in the previous question, I did subtraction. <coughs> I did subtraction and I cancelled 2x and 2x. So the x term was cancelled in the previous problem. Now here, um, if you observe this one, both are positive. Both are belongs to the same um, symbol. Therefore, I subtracted when I subtract only the term the second one or the below one will get change because uh, it is uh, uh, first equation minus a second equation minus will goes to the second equation only therefore here it will be plus and here it will be minus therefore opposite sides automatically cancel but here the signs already opposite one is plus another one is minus so you need not to multiply with minus what will happen if you multiply with minus uh, this will be 3x minus 4x and uh, here 4y plus 4y so you can get another third equation will come in x and y so it is prolonging so whenever the signs are opposite go directly for the addition 1 plus 2 is the same to 2 plus 1 now when they are adding plus 4y minus 4y are going to cancel and 3x plus 4x now we are adding that is 7x and 10 plus 4 that is 14 therefore x is equal to 14 by 7 that is 2 now we got a x value 2 and you select any of the equation here two equations but the two equations has uh, um, second forms are there that mean uh, the, this is the 3x plus 4y 3x plus 4y but here I multiplied you can take any one of the equation just you can I select it I select this one 3x plus 4y is equal to 10 and substitute a 2 value here therefore 3 2's plus 4y is equal to 10 that is a 6 plus 4y equal to 10 4y is equal to 10 minus 6 4y is equal to 4 by 4 that is 1 therefore x value is 2 y value is 1 now for our clarity and confident just go for the check at every time check is not given in the textbook but for our comfort just uh, you can take any of the equation 2x minus 2y equal to 2 substitute uh, x value and y value 2 2s are 4 minus 2 1s are 2 that is 4 minus 2 is equal to 2 we got rhs therefore and this is the way we can do the elimination now for every bit in the first problem they are asking us to do in both the methods elimination method and substitution method now let's go to the substitution method now 3x plus 4y is equal to 10 
and two uh, x minus two y mine is equal to two. Now take the two common here in LHS and RHS already we have two. So here the two is multiplied when it goes to the RHS two by two that is one. X minus y is equal to one. So x is equal to one plus y substitute this value in this equation so 3 in place of x we have a 1 plus y plus 4y equal to 0 so 3 is going to distribute 3 ones are 3 y's plus 4y is equal to 10 3 3 y plus 4y is equal to 7 y is equal to 10 7 y is equal to 10 minus 3 7 y is equal to 7 uh, and y is equal to 1 now take any of the equation and substitute so this equation is equal to this equation this equation is equal to this equation this is equal to this this is equal to this this is a simplified form these two are the simplified forms because we are just reducing the two so I select uh, x minus y equal to 1 substitute y value you will get x value is equal to 2 so uh, we got uh, the same x value 2 y value 1 in the both the methods so um, we got it by substitution method that's all